All right, so for the last video of the day, we are gonna be running a team that I use all the time because it just so happens to be one of my favorite categories in the entire game, and that would be Majin Power. So without further ado, let's jump into stage 47. I'm sure we have a lot of options here. There we go. Okay, so are any of these guys actually maxed out though? This guy's not even close. How about this guy? Uh, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. I'll take that. Okay, so we'll grab him. And this is the team we're gonna go with. We got the double Fizz Boo Tankses, Int Kid Boo, Tech Buff Boo, uh, AGL Fit Boo, the Tech Exchange Boo, and finally the AGL Bukalo, Wickalo, Boo Piccolo, whatever you wanna call him. Doesn't really matter. Items are the same as always. And uh, yeah, let's do this, guys. Now, in terms of rotations, I do want to have at least one boot tanks for uh, every turn, and probably hmm, the boo piccolo with one of them, and then maybe kid boo with the other. We'll see. We'll see. Okay, so the boot tanks are pretty solid defensively. The buff boo not as much. Now, is that going to be a problem? I'm not sure. It could be a problem. It could be a problem. Okay, so we're definitely going to pop a Whis right here. Just to be safe. And let's go for uh, Supreme Kai here. That's going to be a nice 18 key super. Uh, let's go to Gohan. Uh, what should I do? Okay, I'll give these to Buff Boo. And then we'll give these to the Boo Tanks. There we go. Okay, so double 18 key supers. As long as Buff Boo does not get supered by Supreme Kai, I think we'll be all right. If he does get supered, Whis might save us, but I'm not sure if it's gonna be enough. Although I'm not sure if Supreme Kai is still gonna be alive by then, judging by how much damage we just did. Oh my God, the additional Normal attack, came in clutch. Damn, all right, so we're good. We're good to go. <laughs> Some really nice damage from Buff Boo as well. Um, gonna get supered here. At least it's not type disadvantage, so. That's still a lot of damage. <laughs> that's still pretty bad, all right. <laughs> so it seems like these enemies on this stage hit pretty hard, so. I'm gonna be extra cautious this time around. Um, oh my god, look at Buff Boo's defense, man. That is crazy. Okay, so you put Buff Boo in the front, and he can also stun, so maybe he'll just stun uh, the Saiyan man. And I think we got this. I think we got this. He's not gonna take any damage, that's for sure. And he dodges too, forgot about that. He has a, is it 30% or 50%? He has a good chance to dodge. He has a good chance to dodge. I forgot exactly what the percentage was. But all right, man, that is uh, that is a good look. I like that. And this guy can stun too. So this rotation has two guys that can stun. Um, I might just keep that as a rotation. Might be a good call. Hmm. So maybe we have one rotation with Boo Tanks and uh, Kid Boo, and then the other rotation with Boo Piccolo and uh, Fit Boo. That could work. That could definitely work. Now we're gonna put Boo Tanks in front. Um, let's pop another Whis, right? Because these guys don't, uh, I mean, rather they do hit quite hard. And Let's go for, let's go for Go 10 because then we can hit him with the Kid Boo who's going to do a lot of damage and uh, hopefully we can take out Go 10 this turn as well. Ooh, okay, there's a super. Oh man. Okay. Okay, I <laughs> was not expecting that. 
I was expecting some damage, not that much damage. Holy crap, oh my god. We got lucky there was not a second super because we would have been done. If there was a second super, we would have been done. No question. Alright, healed up. Um, healed back up with the uh, Princess Snake. Got some extra damage reduction. And... Um... Let's see... So, we can... Maybe go for the stun on Trunks. And then I definitely want to kill Goten. And uh, I don't think it really matters too much. Like, what would be fine either way on this turn. But last turn was scary, man. I did not think that Boo Tanks was going to take 240,000 after a Whis. After a Whis. I just did not make any sense to me. It did not. It did not. Okay, so we're going to take out uh, Trunks here. Or sorry, Goten here for sure. He's dead. He's dead. And now there's this Trunks who's almost dead too. So we'll make it out of here alive. But <laughs> for a moment, I thought it wasn't going to happen. Uh, for a moment, I thought we were screwed. We got the evil Boo transformation. Um, should I keep him? Should I keep him? Why not? Let's let's let him get a little bit of shine too. So I'm gonna swap out Kid Boo for uh, Tech Boo, or sorry, for Int Kid. Wait, no, sorry, I'm getting the Boos mixed up. I'm gonna swap out Kid Boo for the Evil Boo for the Tech Boo, and hopefully he doesn't let me down. Hopefully this does not end up being a mistake. I think it's gonna be okay though, cause he has good damage reduction. He has uh. You know, dodge chance and all that stuff, so I'm not too concerned. Uh I'm a little bit concerned about this though. Um let's see. We're gonna try to stun both of them. That's for sure. Let's try okay, let's pop the Icarus. And then let's also pop the Aider for extra defense. Uh mainly for the tech boo, because he does not have a lot of defense, at least relatively speaking. And, uh, yeah, let's try to stun Goku first, and then we'll go for the stun on Vegeta. And, uh, give these orbs to buff Boo. Got a dodge, nice. Second dodge. Beautiful. Yeah, buff Boo, or, or Fit Boo is doing great, man. If you guys don't have Fit Boo, you haven't tried to use him yet, he's worth a shot. He's worth a shot. He, he should help you quite a bit, especially if you have dupes in him. But even if you don't, um, still, still quite good. Okay, so we just need Goku to not super us, which he didn't. Amazing. Uh, Vegeta is still stunned. So let's do... Hold on, who's... Wait, which boo is better? Oh, the friend boo is better than mine? Wait, is my boo maxed out? He is. But why is the friend... Boo. Oh wait, did the friend boo super first? Maybe. Alright, so I'll leave the friend boo... Wait, no. They didn't get to attack yet. So how come his boo has more defense than mine? Oh, skill orb, of course. <laughs> I'm dumb. Okay, skill orb makes sense. Uh, let's go for Goku. Um, ooh. Let me think. So we have the extra defense. We also have Icarus. So even if, let's say, uh, even if the, the Super Saiyan 3 Goku supers us, we should be able to hold up okay. Like, it, it might do like two, 300k, but it wouldn't kill us by any means. Right? Yeah. I hope, at least. <laughs> We're so close, it would really suck if we died. I don't think we will though, I, I took extra precaution. We have two item effects active right now, we have the Aider and the, the, the Icarus. Oh god. Okay! Pretty much as expected, <laughs> pretty much as expected. 
I can take that, you know? I, I can take that. That's okay. That's just fine. Additional super. Let's go. Give me another crit. Kill Goku, please. Do it. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. Yes. Okay. Um. Now all we got to do is Princess Snake it up. Okay. And... I think we're fine. I think we're fine. I'm going to put the uh, Fit Boo in the front just in case Vegeta decides to super us first. Um, and we'll probably stun him again and the next turn we'll finish him off if he doesn't die this turn. This stage is pretty chill, to be honest. I mean... We had, our, we had our moments. <laughs> uh, definitely there was a scare. But overall, um, not bad. Not bad. To be fair, Majin Power is a very powerful category, right? It's a very good category. So I'm not really surprised that we didn't struggle too much. It is, at the end of the day, as I said, one of my favorite categories. I run it all the time, so I'm quite familiar with these units. And uh, they did not let me down. They definitely did not let me down. But well, there you go, guys. That's going to be the last video of the day. We just did... Uh, what do you call it? We did Earthlings. I was going to say Humanity, but that's not right. Earthlings and also uh, Special Pose. So this was the third one. I'm done with Dokkan for the time being. We'll be, we'll be back hopefully tomorrow with um, three more stages to finish out the new 10. And then after that, I can get my LR trunks and we can do our uh, showcase as well. So for the time being, I'm going to leave you off with Shape Up slash Fit Boo, just because he was, in my opinion, the MVP of this team, of this run. And uh, as always, if you guys liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button. To join the Tiger Squad now, and while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.